Hi, and welcome to the video for podcast from Renesas, the worldwide's number one supplier of microcontrollers and microprocessors. Today we're going to focus on two things. First of all, we're going to focus on the Super H, the 32-bit microprocessor and microcontroller family from Renesas. And second of all, we're going to focus on you. The Super H has been designed to make your life easier. Simple programming tools, reference diagrams, and great support mean that no matter what you're doing with your free time, you'll have more of it if you're using the Super H. Everywhere you imagine, Renesis Technology. My name is Robert Kalman and I'm the marketing engineer responsible for the Super H controller family in Europe. I'm going to be taking you through the slides today and first of all I want to show you the wide portfolio of our Super H family. Ranging from the highest performance with dedicated peripherals for connectivity such as USB, uh, CAN and Ethernet or for visualization such as TFT drivers and dedicated graphics engines right the way down to the cost effective general purpose SH Tiny device. The focus of today's podcast is the SH7136 and SH7137 devices. It is an ideal entry level device for inverter applications requiring fast and accurate ADCs, dedicated timer units and CAN connectivity. The SH7137 and SH7136 include all of the features that you would expect from a high performance device designed for mid-range inverter applications. It includes a 12-bit ADC with 1.25 microsecond conversion time. It has a special motor control timer, which we'll discuss later. The device operates at 5 volts or 3.3 volts and incorporates all of the connectivity that you would expect from a mid-range inverter microcontroller. There you go, you see? Your mind's made up. You can leave the office right now and go and spend your time doing what it is you enjoy doing in your free time. The MTU2 timer is also on the SH7136 and 7137 devices. This timer can support all of the standard functions that you would expect from a timer, but also has a great many functions to support inverter applications. The timer is capable of generating three-phase complementary PWM signals and automatically inserting dead time into these PWM signals to ensure safe operation. It will also measure the real dead time detected at the output stage and ensure optimum performance. The timer has circuitry which understands common encoder interfaces and can trigger the ADC with an optional delay so that the ADC measurement can be synchronized. The MTU2 includes fast hardware mechanism to automatically shut off the timer for safety purposes. And finally, the output pins have sufficient drive strength, up to 15 milliamps, to directly drive opto isolators. There you go, wasn't that easy? Your inverter implementation is simple with the SH7137 and 7136. Now stop spending so much time in the office and go home. So it doesn't matter what you do in your free time, you'll have more of it with the SH. I hope you enjoyed all the additional free time. If Super H wasn't making your life easy enough already, Renesis has done it all for you. For the Super H there are now motor control reference platforms available for induction motors and brushless AC motors. They utilize the latest field oriented control mechanism and sensorless measurement. The flash and RAM usage is very small and the code is available from your local Renesas support contacts. Okay, so it couldn't be easier. Stop spending so much time in the office, go home and enjoy your free time.
So no matter what you do with your free time, you have more of it with the SA. Everywhere you imagine, Renesis Technology.